They're almost as clingy as my ex-girlfriends. <laughs> don't don't put that on there. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, today we're actually gonna do whatever we planned in Copenhagen because yesterday didn't turn out the way we wanted to. Tivoli Gardens was closing by the time we got there, so all we could do is uh, check out sort of what's in there and plan what we were going to do there for today. So today we're checking out Castle, looking at the gardens yet again, and then we're gonna go to one of the biggest aquariums there is in Europe. Uh, it's about 11 o'clock. We should be able to hit all that all at once. Um, yeah, and we're, we're gonna see exactly how Denmark is in comparison to Sweden, and I'm in the back of my mind also gonna do the, the comparison between Denmark and Seattle, because it's still Scandinavian, sort yes. of? It's still considered Scandinavian, so... But there are definitely differences, even in the few hours that we've been here that we've noticed between Denmark and Sweden, so maybe at the end of the day we'll be able to recap it. Or maybe not, it just depends on how it goes, so... That's not gonna help. I'm already dying inside slowly but surely. Aren't we all? <laughs> so, as an update, we are heading right now to the Rosenberg Palace, not the Frederiksberg Palace. Because apparently the Frederiksberg one is in uh, another city and we are completely transportationless. Um, we have no way of getting there. Yes we do, we have feet. That, it's, it, it's a seven hour walk. Pizza shawarma burger. I'm reading it. Where? Right, right above you. He wasn't lying. If you ever wondered whether uh, the Danes are economic, not economically, environmentally friendly, the answer is a resounding yes. <laughs> There's bikes everywhere. Bikes and electric scooters seem to be the main method of transportation besides walking. What's that sound in the background? Is that a car? Bus. <sighs> Ooh. It seems very focused on like environmentally friendly practices. Even the Swedish bullet train that we took, I, I bullet train, was uh, pretty environmentally friendly. It was 100% recyclable energy. So quite a bigger focus on that here than there would be in a lot of places in the States. And we're here. Update, Jake and I have the ability to get in because we bought a Copenhagen card, but uh, big, big boy over here. My Wait, bank won't let me buy it. <laughs> so we got to figure out how exactly to get him a card. Otherwise, well, you could always get in. You'll just pay extra. He's got a lot of money. No. He's got a small loan of a million dollars. This is true. Hey, this is true. I can't go in recording. So <laughs> <laughs> this has to be cut. Too late. It's going in. <laughs> so as we wait, we're going to quickly give some therapy to Kate here because he's got a lot of issues. You two have made it worse. <laughs> what have we made worse? <laughs> All you do is insult me and think that's gonna fix it. Another quick update. Apparently inside this castle there's the crown jewels. What exactly those are, I am not sure. Let me but show you. We will update. Oh, I'm I'm definitely not recording that. Jake. All night. Oh, he's dead. All night. All night. <laughs> 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 uh, we're testing out exactly what's gonna be like when Kate gets uh gets himself committed. Any comment? Can't wait. It's gonna be a good time. You heard it here, folks. Hey, Exxon, have you actually ever seen one of these? Uh, a lot of castles have them now. It's called a Disson vacuum. And what it does is it vacuum. sucks in air. Yeah. <laughs> vacuum? <laughs> vacuum. He couldn't even keep the bit correctly. <sighs> That's the three of us at the end of this trip. The question is, who becomes a centaur? Self-reflection room. Anything you reflected on? Yes. If I sneeze, I die. <laughs> You're being watched. Well, the Thanks on you like God's ships always watching like ships for you.
He's breaking the rules. Yeah, there's no rules. Already we got a criminal. Yeah, I got that. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so bad at this, okay. I just <laughs> I decided to take us to a I know, I decided to take us to a local cafe to get some cafe and Jake got chocolate. He's a happy boy. I didn't get anything. And as a side note, every time he speaks to a local person here, he uses an accent. I don't know how to feel about that. I swear it's on accident. I don't mean to. It just comes out of me. It's really weird. There's a Trying not to be too creepy, and I'm failing. That's normal. Yeah. There's so many bicycles. Do you think they know there's cars? Nope. That aquarium. in the morning. They're almost as clingy as my ex-girlfriends. <laughs> don't don't put that on there. <laughs> Classic exhibit found here in Scandinavia. Rainforest. Ooh, it's humid. I am the stablest of stablers. <laughs> Fades away. Oh, it's a party. Aquarium done, finito. And now we uh, we move on to the next piece, which is home. It's, it's been pretty interesting. I don't know if I can comment too much on the whole culture thing that I said was the goal at the beginning because uh, it's been mostly tourists. But uh, maybe maybe the night will change things. Probably won't, but maybe. Eggs on get the good <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna include that. <laughs> I'll let you go first. Uh oh. <laughs> You're bleeding from the ear. Yes. Yes. I can't. I can't use this. Good. I can't use other people's comedy. I mean, you have been this whole time. That's not true. It's been our comedy. <laughs> we. <laughs> I know how to get this party going. What party? Take your pants off. Oh boy. Let's get showered. Let's get showered up so that we're all naked. Wait, then we can go to Lady Love. <laughs> Are you still looking at Lady Love? No. I'm looking at strip clubs in Stockholm. <laughs> Should have brought uh, pajama pants. For these late nights. You brought oh. pajama pants. Just take your pants off. And then take them in. Take them and these off. Uh, and oh, pajama pants. Dodges. <laughs> take them off. Yeah. And then if anyone ever knocks, we can all run out there just like waggling, just like, what do you want? <laughs> Is that what we're gonna do? <laughs> and they're gonna be like, oh! That would terrify a lot of people, oh. yeah. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if I want See, my... the thing about that is, what if you walk out and no one's terrified? Then they don't I understand. I can use that to my advantage too. Because <laughs> <laughs> Abraham was like, cut off the penis, and then they only took part of it. Not all of it. Just, just the top, just the tip. The more just you the take, tip. the more devout you are. <laughs> <laughs> Step aside, Exxon. Let me give the people a show. What? No. Oh. oh, yeah. <sighs> For you. <sighs> what the hell was that? Oh 
Holy crap! Oh, what is that? Oh, it's rancid. Oh. Is that a fart or a burp? I think that came out of his ass. Oh. Oh. <laughs> How are you done already? What do you mean? It's pee. Then what the f was that? It was a singular fart. <laughs> it was a warning shot. <laughs> I was on my way out when I felt it coming because I knew it was going to be the stinky one. <laughs> so I tried to step out for you boys. I knew it was gonna be a sticky one. It's still here! <laughs> Do my great Gatsby pose. <laughs> Every fart. You're a monster. Oh, it's, it's still here. It's burning <laughs> my eyes. It's pretty bad. Jesus. I'm, I'm sorry. Do something. Sorry, fellas. Let me zip up my zipper. <laughs> Nothing else gets Don't out. Go open and close the front door many times and try to air it out in here. It's not a bad idea. Oh, those poor girls. <laughs> what? Some girls were walking by the second I opened the door. He's <laughs> gonna slam the <laughs> <house Yeah>. with <laughs> it. Oh. <laughs> we were drunk. <laughs> it's a thud. Jake, what do you want to see? <laughs> Jake, what is it you want to see? <laughs> <laughs> I want to see your fat lips around this bitch talking to you, Kate. Good thing we can cut all that out. I look like a local. No, you don't. People talk to me in Danish all the time. That because you're in Denmark. Just for some context, these next few clips are all of Kate's attempts to try and get us to go out that night. I'll keep a running counter for you. Just stay here, save your money for tomorrow, and we go and get drunk. But what if we could what? do both? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to wake up tomorrow and be miserable. One, because I'm waking up early, and two, because I'm hungover. So don't be either. <laughs> <laughs> this is when he goes into like, I need it! <laughs> <laughs> I, just, I don't need it. I don't need it. I okay. don't need it. Okay. Uh, I need listen, it. Listen, boys. <laughs> <laughs> listen here. <laughs> let, me, let me tell you. I'm about to give okay. yes, but yeah. actually no. <laughs> I'm about to give you. Well, yes, but actually, <laughs> so, hey. he's about to give us a speech <laughs> to win a cat. Little boys, sit down. <laughs> let me tell you how men do this. <laughs> Three different nightlife options, okay? Okay. Two of them are the top 20 bars in Copenhagen. Okay? They are within a quarter mile of each other. Bistro get. Where we were earlier. Where we didn't do anything. Now we can go back and do stuff with the people of Copenhagen. On a Monday. <laughs> Everything's closed on Monday. The only places that are open are going to be these two places. Because they're all going to work tomorrow. <laughs> no one else is and like we us. we aren't, so we should show them how Americans do it. It's going to be late. <laughs> You're getting shaky without your booze. <laughs> like, Look, the sun's not even down. It's a little down. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's down. It's There is no sun. It's we were in Sweden and so we light out. It's 11 oh. o'clock. It's actually 11-11. Eleven, eleven. I make a wish. And I wish. <laughs> Jake would put his pants back on. His pants are on. Well, just because it's got some plumber's crack doesn't mean... Are they buttoned? Yes. Hell yeah. No, that does. Because <laughs> they're buttoned. In what way does that not count as buttoned when they are literally buttoned? When your belly, underwear, <laughs> and zipper are all showing. <laughs> because I was showing you the evidence. What do you want me to do? <laughs> you just don't want me to be right. So you're well, like. 
<laughs> and must attack this person. <laughs> Only by whittling his defenses down can Despite I get through. Despite you being right, I'm gonna say everything. These other things that don't have anything to do with it make you wrong. That's right. I thought you were gonna show. I'm going to. Yeah, go ahead. This feels like a trap. <laughs> <laughs> Like your pants are already buttoned. <laughs> <laughs> Came back right at you. <laughs> oh, you just put that zipper up. Put them, put them pants on. <laughs> what? Put them pants on. That's not right. All right, fine. <laughs> Quick new update, or rather, just update in general. We were supposed to go to Tivoli. We were supposed to do something, but. It's a little late. We have a train at 10 o'clock tomorrow. A plane? Trains at like 8. This should give you an idea of why we're not going to totally eat. I'm, I'm a little burned out. Um, so we're just gonna stay in and uh, drink this free wine bottle that the hotel gave us. Uh, courtesy of Hotels.com. Hashtag sponsor. Please, yeah, so we're just gonna hang out in the hotel room for the final bit. I'm gonna dump all of my footage into my hard drive. <laughs> He's gonna dump again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna drop all the footage into my hard drive. And then once that's done, um, I'll probably break the toilet again. No, that's not, <laughs> that's not my job. That's a YouTube's job. I wish I could right now. There we go. So, t tonight's just a relaxing night. Final, final sort of hours in Copenhagen before we go off back to Sweden. Cheers for that. And, uh, yeah. For the most part, we're done here. <laughs>